Good morning, Vloggy Vlog. What is up? What is up? What is up? You Coming guys. You I was going to do like a funny little like, foy, foy, foy. <laughs> a funny <laughs> intro. And then I like got too scared. So. She, she got freaked out. <laughs> so we're here with this intro instead but anyway we are coming to you live from gilly t do you actually know how to say it Chirungan, isn't it? Chirungan? Chirungan. i don't know Chirungan. the height dynamic in this is just odd i feel like i need to step forward step forward I, if i'm like right here hey. <laughs> it's just it's just all wrong but we love a tall boy, don't we? Don't want a short boy. Want a tall boy. <laughs> um, but yeah, we are coming to you live from Gilly Tea. We checked in yesterday and usually the first day of travel, we don't vlog because we're just like unpacking as you probably can see behind us. We are checking in. We are exploring, mm -hmm. figuring out where food is. So we checked in, got lunch. Um, but the journey here, you guys, story time. The journey here was... <laughs> Very interesting. I'm not going to lie. Strange. I honestly thought, I thought for a second, we're done. I thought we're done. We're getting abducted. Like, that's it. We're going to be held for ransom. I really did. Honest, honest to God. I was like, we're going to be held for ransom. So what happened is we organized a private transfer through the hotel because, you know, private things. Why not? So we organized a private boat transfer through the hotel. When we got to Gilly Air, we did a like commercial mm. boat with lots of people. And then the hotel said we can organize a private one. So we did it. Um, and so we picked us right up on the beach, like right out in front, front of, front of our, our hotel. hotel. So, so we weren't, off. yeah, we weren't having to contend with lots of people on like the boat ramps because it gets a bit chaotic around here trying to get on and off boats. Mm. We weren't contending with a horse and cart to try and get our luggage to the um, harbour. Oh, nearly dropped it. The harbour. <laughs> Um, so we were like, yes, awesome. And it worked out to be like $40 Australian, which is great. Um, so it was just $20 extra. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so we um, we got this boat and it was organized through one of the staff at the hotel. So the hotels mm -hmm. around here, they don't really, I think there's like laws, like they can't organize stuff for you, but the staff can. So mm -hmm. for example, where we are right now, we organized bikes um, for the island and the manager was saying the hotel can't, so there's a law, he can't supply us with bikes through the hotel. However, him as a person can get someone that can get us bikes. So that's what's happened with this transfer. The hotel hasn't organized it. One of the staff members there knew people that were doing private transfers and organized it. Okay. And so the boat pulled up and it looked fine. It was all good. It was just us. And it was three, three guys and us on this boat. And we got on and the vibe was just weird. Like the vibe. I, I, I said to get out to one of them in the first one, didn't say a word. And it was just like, I was like, okay, this is a bit sus. The vibe was yeah, sus. Yeah, and it was like, that is for real weird. And the dude, the main dude um, that I was talking to when we spoke, like the organ, um, talked about the pickup, it. like do the pickup time and stuff. On WhatsApp? Yeah, he was sitting on the boat and then it was like, yeah, is this... If the vibe was just, it was it's, just odd. It when was you feel just, something, when you know you feel something, you feel you something. You feel something. Like, something. Yeah, it was just odd. It was strange. And we got on and I was wearing mm. my pearls. Um, I, I brought pearls from Ireland, so I was wearing these pearls. And he was like, ooh, nice pearls. And the way that he said it, I mm. was like, oh, no. And because we had like the Louis, we had Big Louis, my Big Louis Vuitton bag. We had the camera. Like we had a lot of stuff. And I was like, I hope they think that it's fake. <laughs> I hope they think that we've just gotten this fake designer from Bali. Um, and honestly, you guys, with us traveling, we don't, we actually don't have a lot of designer. Like I wear yeah, a lot of designer. Really. We've left most of it at home. We've just got the big tote bag to carry mm -hmm. around. So we're really mindful um, about the the stuff. Mm -hmm. And this is all like dress jewelry. It's all costume jewelry. So it's not like real, real gold or anything like that. So we've left the valuables at home. So he said that, which was really odd. And then mm -hmm. he was making small talk. And then another guy was sitting next to him and he was just like, he wouldn't even talk to us. He wouldn't yeah, I took it out of him too. And he was just like, hmm. Yeah. I was like, all right. So I started to get a bit like on edge. And then, yeah, then, um, and then, yeah, then he took a photo of you. He took a photo of I me. I didn't see it. 
He got his uh, phone out in front of him and he was taking photos of me and I was like, and Ethan didn't see it and I looked at Ethan and Ethan knew something was up. I was like, this is fucking weird. And I was like, oh my gosh, are we getting pirated? Are we, are they like going to hold us for ransom? That's why they're taking photos. And then they asked where we were staying so that they could drop us near because we're on an island so that they could drop us near where we were staying so we didn't have to walk far. Which at the time felt fine, but now that I look back at it, I'm like, they know what we look like and they know where we're staying. But we're safe. We're safe and we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. But it was just in that moment, you're like, oh, God, what's happening? You know, (laughs) fight or flight, fight or flight. Um, And then I was like, oh, they're actually going to drop us to the right island. But we made it and we're safe. So that's our little story (laughs) of our journey here, which has been fun. It's been great. It's crazy. That's so good. We're we're safe. But vlog fam, if anything happens, you heard it here first. (laughs) No, nothing's going to happen. We are fine. And that's why I said I was was like, nothing's going to happen. Like, why would you look at him? Like, look, look at the size of him, as if. Well, that's what I said to us. If we weren't heading to, head into Buddy Gilly T, we're going the opposite direction. They'll be getting thrown off the fucking boat and I'll be driving it instead of Buddy's following yeah. yourself. So I was like, there's just no way. Yeah, like, not happening. <clears throat> it'd be silly. It'd be silly. Mm. So anyway, that's our story time and our little intro. Oh, welcome to the vlog. Oh, welcome <laughs> to this episode. We're very excited. Um, we filmed the villa yesterday because... Mm. Before we check into any place, we like to film the villa before we, you know, make it ours and throw our stuff everywhere. So we did that. We've woken up today. We were going to get some content. As you guys know, first day we do content for socials, but it's really miserable here and I think it's going to storm. So yeah, it started raining last night. And yeah. And like, like, yeah, it's been having power outages too. Yeah. It's been a bit crazy. It's been a bit strange. We spoke to um, some lovely, a lovely couple on the other side. I'm from the pool where we are, and yeah. um, they're from Germany, and they said, yeah, it's been great. And today's, the, oh, yesterday was the first day they had a bit of a power outage, but I think it could be a little storm. There could be works going on around yeah. somewhere, but yeah. So uh, we're not going to do content today. We're mm-hmm. probably going to wait until Monday. Um, Monday, I'm doing a money mindset training in my membership. So I'm going to get ready to do my full makeup and stuff like here. I like that. And it gets really hot over here too. Mm-hmm. So if I'm putting makeup up, honestly, I take it off as soon as I don't need it because my skin just reacts bad. So Monday, um, we've got good Wi-Fi. So I'm going to go and do my training there. So I'll finally. Be, yeah, <laughs> finally. So I'll be ready um, and I'll be put together. So we'll just do content on Monday. That mm-hmm. makes sense. Um, and then today we are just going to go for a little hot girl walk. We're going to yes. go for a walk, get some coffee, have a look around. We've seen a really cute cat cafe. Um, <laughs> she got so excited when we rode past on the push bike yesterday. I was like, babe, look, look at this. She's like, oh, it's a cat cafe. <laughs> Obviously, they probably just got all the strays, though. And they're probably just making do, yeah. money off of all the stray cats around here. <laughs> strays aren't getting enough and just a little biscuit. <laughs> they just, like, come in and then they put them out at night, probably. They're like, off you go back to the streets. Um, so, yeah, so we're going to go for a walk and have a look around. And, um, and yeah, we'll mm. take you guys along for the ride. Sure. So we're currently on a walk to have a look around in Gilly T. Uh, we just pulled off into the cat calf. What they do is actually like um, there's a lady there, um, rescues cats, um, and then you can like donate and just helps get them whatever and find some homes and stuff. But one of the biggest problems on Gilly is that um, everyone has cats because due to the I think possibly what she said due to the um, Muslim culture. Um, the religion that dogs are dirty, so that's why there's no dogs on the Gilly Islands. So that's why there's a lot of cats 
But um, yeah, there's heaps of kittens and everything. You were loving it, weren't you? I was. They're so cute. Oh, so cute. <laughs> it was really cute. So we stopped in, gave a few pats, gave some money, donated, and we are off on our next adventure. <laughs> no, in all seriousness. <laughs> Are we doing good now? In all seriousness. We, uh, we... It's, it's four o'clock and we haven't vlogged much all day since this morning. We haven't done any vlogging. Yeah, no. Because we went on a mushroom journey. <laughs> <laughs> we, oh. um... We only got a mushroom. We got a mushroom smoothie. smoothie. They call it a shake, but it's more like a smoothie because yeah. it's like, what was it? It's banana. No, you said banana, but you yeah. didn't put banana in it. There was banana in it. Was there? No, hey, it was pineapple. No, no. Hey, just pineapple, lime. Pineapple, lime, Sprite, mushrooms. Yeah, that's it. There's no banana. Why did you say banana? Huh? He said banana. I swear he said banana at the start. Anyway, I'll stop it. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> So, yeah. Um, yeah, we had that, and then we've just been <laughs> having a good little trip. It's been fun. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. we're done now, and we just literally mm. went and got cake. <laughs> <laughs> we got carrot cake and um, the We got flowers. chocolate cake chocolate and cake. carrot so cake. Good. Um, it was so good. And then, yeah, we were having a chat to the manager of the restaurant. Mm. And that pretty much sobered us up real quick. Yes. <laughs> Trying to be serious for that long. <laughs> um, uh, but it was fun. It was a whole heap of fun. Um, so, yeah. So, we're just chilling. It's mm. uh, it's so miserable here. Like, we went for a swim before and stuff. Mm. But it's... It's just... It's, rain is yeah. coming and going. It's like it's overcast. Not great. It's just... Yeah. Yes. It's a muddy mess, especially like where we, where we are too, like where we're staying. The track isn't like um like the, the road. road. <laughs> it's a tra track. The track. Road like, yeah. is like mud. Mm -hmm. Like there's just, it's just mud and water, and so mm -hmm. yeah, we've got bicycles, but we're not gonna. It's kind of just having a chill day today. Do you know what you said to me before? What? <laughs> Do you remember? What? He said he goes to me because we were going for our walk to get cake. <laughs> And you go, let's take our motorbikes. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, first of all, we have bicycles. <laughs> we don't have motorbikes. <laughs> Second of all, <laughs> are you literally, you are so adamant, let's take our motorbikes. <laughs> and second of all, I'm not. I'm not riding in this because I will get in a you, mud you pit. You barely function. <laughs> not fun. you were functioning. But even just, like uh, me, fully alert, I can't ride in mud. Yeah. I, I can't. <laughs> I can't even ride normal. Like, oh. Which, this, this is the thing that got it every time. I'll show you. No, stop, stop, <laughs> stop. No. <laughs> one's I did this to her. She lost it. I like, was it in the I've pool. I've never laughed too? so hard. No, no, in here at the door. We were trying to get to the pool <laughs> and you just split your sunnies and I've never laughed so hard about something yeah. so not funny, but it was the funniest thing. Yeah, it was fun. I nearly wet myself. I nearly wet myself. It was fun. It was a really cool mm. experience. We had a light to medium dose. Yeah, we didn't have a crazy dose. Didn't have a crazy dose. Didn't want to go crazy. Um, well, you're not, you're not sure what it's like, really. Yeah. Yeah, because they go off like cones. Yes, it's, it's like, a, like little a cone cup. Banana leaf in it. Yeah, and they like fill it with them. a certain amount of mushrooms. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that was totally fun. Definitely seeing the flamingos mm. on the wall <laughs> move. <laughs> the floor. Yeah, the floor. It's pretty, pretty damn trippy. We were hyper fixated on the floor. <laughs> and it was just fun. Yeah, it was, it was cool. Good, it was a good You, you got to come, you, when you go on the gills, you, gotta, you just got to do it. Yeah, well, if you, but you also have to be in the mm. right state yeah, to do it. Not you have to be very, like, happy mm. um, when you are going on a psychedelic experience mm. because whatever you're feeling is going to be amplified. Mm. So if you're not feeling your true self and if you're not feeling happy, don't do it. Yeah, no, don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> I'm going to pay for fucking lunch. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> he went to pay for lunch. He, you did pay for lunch. Yeah. And there was, like, there was literally only two people next to him. Like, there was someone oh, behind no, the bar no. and there was someone next to him. Doing the ATM machine and he pays and then he comes over to me and he goes, Did you see all those people? There were so many people around me. And I was like, like a swarmed around. I was like, he's people around and I looked dumb and then like And I was yeah. like, there was no there was two people around you. He's like, I swore there was so many people around. <laughs> oh, that was a pretty good cool experience. Uh, yeah. 
It's so we, we've had a fun day. Mm. We've had what else to do when it's like raining and miserable? Yeah, that's right. Go Can have you know. a mushroom smoothie <laughs> on the beach. Go lay in bed, look at your flamingo wall, trip <laughs> out, look at the floor, go for a swim, go get some cake, uh, and then you're good. Yeah, that's fine. It's how many hours has it been? It's been what three? Oh, uh, it's the time now. Mm. So it's been four, and then we started at eleven. Yeah, so, at eleven o'clock. We didn't kick until about twelve. So it's been yeah, yeah four hours. That's good. Really good. <laughs> so that's the update from today. Hence why we've been terrible vlogs. We did not. <laughs> you guys did not need to see me laughing over him putting a pair of sunglasses on backwards. <laughs> Honestly, it's not. It's not the vibe. Oh, not, let's go. not the vibe. <laughs> Going out for a walk. The, into, it's not the main part, isn't it? Yeah, it's yeah. like the... It's not the main part of uh, Gilly Tea. It's where like a lot of the, um, like the pubs and like, the clubs and stuff are. Um, it's just really the party area, isn't it? Yeah, it's just busy. It's pretty, it's not too busy today because of the rain. Everything's been quite wet, so everything's, um, yeah, it's a bit quiet, but other than that, it's there, uh, so. Hey, yes, yeah. Mate? What's up, mate? What's up, mate? Hey, <laughs> what a big mate! To the vlog, mate. How are you, mate? How are you, mate? But yeah, so, kind of locals. decided that we're not going to tag or give you the name of where we are for dinner. It is very beautiful, but we sat down, we ordered food, food got delivered, you know, we've taken photos, we've gone to tag the restaurant and we've gotten a warning on Instagram that the name, and I'm not going to say the name, but the name essentially has got to do with children. Um, I have to think, choose my words carefully so that this video doesn't get banned and we don't get blocked. But essentially, it's um, harm. And uh, I don't even know how else to say it in a way. But you, it's really messed up stuff. The, this name of this restaurant has a direct correlation to really messed up stuff that happens to kids that we're all aware of that's happening right now in our society. So we're very icked out to say the least, like, we wish we would have known, yeah, we wish that we would have known what the name meant, and I have no fucking idea why anyone would name a restaurant this name, because it's it's really clear what it means in, I assume it's Spanish, mm. um, but we don't want to give it any, like, highlight, um, and in saying that, though, it is really quiet here, so I can only assume that people have cotton on to the name maybe um, and that's why kind of no one's here because it is just it's disgusting and I don't know why anyone would name their restaurant after this so yeah we just we wanted to do a preface if you're wondering why we haven't spoken about this place where it is that's literally why we're disappointed that we're here um, and that we're obviously putting money into this but hindsight is the beautiful thing um, and you know now we know
Good morning, vloggy vlog. Um, we didn't free foot to do an intro this morning. Um, as you probably see, we've already been to the gym. I went to train at Gilly Fit Indonesia, which is on the Gilly T. Awesome gym. Absolutely awesome. Price is really good too. Um, big open gym. Got everything, the free weights, everything like this. They got the free weights go up to like uh, 50 kilos, I think I've seen, or possibly more. Because it was like the other like clip-on ones. But yeah, it's really good. Um, yeah, we walked. We ended up riding. Uh, so we walked there, got a few steps in on the way and on the way back. Come back, just had some breakfast then and uh, had a coffee. And now we're just going to be getting ready for the day. Or we're already kind of getting ready for the day, but... You know, get get what I mean. Um, but yeah, then we're going to be heading down probably for a walk down to uh, the beach there. So probably yeah, sweat what's going on. Not really too sure what's plans for today. Um, but yeah, so we'll take you along. Been up to? We have. Where where are we? Um, <laughs> What's it called? It's called Wa Resort. The Wa Resort. Yeah. Um, it's called Turtle Beach, and we hired a snorkel set, and we went snorkeling with the turtles. There's literal like four or five turtles just out here on the beach. Good like, size ones too. Big ones, big. small ones, big <laughs> ones. <laughs> just swimming up. And we literally were just swimming like beside them, above them, like it was insane, insane. And like we literally paid like what ten dollars Australian for the snorkel gear, like yeah. the fins, the, um, the mouthpiece, and everything, and the goggles. And we're gonna have lunch, and then we're gonna go back out and continue the snorkeling with turtles. And we get yeah, we're gonna get the GoPro then too. And we're also gonna hire. So the camera that we use is not waterproof. <laughs> so that's why when we went snorkeling the other day, like we couldn't get any footage but they actually let you hire GoPros here so it's $30 Australian you can hire it they'll send you the footage we've got SD cards so we're gonna hire a GoPro um, so we can obviously show you guys on this vlog so. What is up you guys? We have been stalking for most of the day. I've already told them that. And then, I know. <laughs> um, and then we went back to the villa and we had a shower, laid on the bed, naked for a while as you do, scrolling TikTok. And now we are out just getting some dinner. We are going to the Jolly Resort for dinner. And then after that, we are going to play some putt-putt and I'm going to win. Yeah, like shit. I am. <laughs> 
How's your box, yours? Is that not mine? <laughs> They're yours. <laughs> A little update. I am going back to vegetarianism. So I was a vegetarian, well, I was actually a vegan for many years. And then I've like gone in and out of vegetarianism. And the last like ever since I met you, <laughs> I've started eating a lot of meat. And it's really like inflamed me. I don't like my gut health doesn't respond well to me and I've had my microbiome tested like we've done a lot of work with my microbiome and my gut health and it came back saying that I shouldn't eat meat but I've been eating meat for the last year so I've decided to go back to being vegetarian um so yeah so that's what we're up to so you have the pork skewers and then Ethan forgot that I was a vegetarian it's day two now of not eating meat and he ordered pork skewers for both of us very kind very very sweet um, yeah, I forgot. I, there's, there's, there's a sade chicken once, but I knew she didn't like the sade here. Yeah. So I was like, oh, I guess the forks, and I totally forgot that she's from vegetarian now. But, yeah. yeah. So here we are. But they looked really good and they smelled good. They were, they were delicious. Yeah. You're going down. <laughs> I'm gonna win. Watch. Oh. <laughs> oh, I thought that was, was close. Three hits. Three. <laughs> no, I'm not blowing any balls, weirdo. No. That was only hole in one. Nearly, but it wasn't. Two or three? Two. Hi! 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 Kids, you're naughty, you're crazy. I know, I've had one of you. So, guys, we're here dad the uh, putt, uh, little mini golf putt putt, um, and we didn't realize how big it actually is. It's 18, 18 holes in it. Yeah, I'll show you. Vloggy vlog, we just got back safe and sound. Yeah, I absolutely smoked. No, Becky. <laughs> no he didn't. No. I won. By we six all knew points. It was gonna happen by six by points. By six points. Yeah. So yeah, I started off strong and then uh, yeah, it just kind of come went, down the end. <laughs> and I started off weak and I went. Ah. <laughs> that was um, actually really cool. It was a really fun pup experience. Yeah, so we went to dinner and then mm. uh, pup pup. It's actually, it's honestly a really cool little course. 
Yeah. Oh, not really little course, quite big. It was a big yeah. course. It's massive, 18 holes. It was fun. But yeah, we, no, was really uh, good. we're going to watch some uh, Sabata Man. Yes. And we're going to go to bed because we have a very busy day tomorrow with very shooting busy content day. Um, and doing lots of work. So, mm. super busy, which is exciting. <laughs> we love being busy, don't we? Yes, we do. Mm. Yes, we do. What is up, vloggy vlog? It is 6 30 a.m. In the morning, we are up, we are dressed, we are ready for the gym. So we are going to meditate, go to the gym, get our workout in, then we'll come back and we'll have breakfast. Um, they cook you breakfast every morning at the villa here, which is really sweet and really nice. Um, <clears throat> are you getting pancakes today? I'm thinking about it. Mm, I think I'm going to get the oatmeal. Um, and then, yeah, and then we have a little bit of work to do. The weather has been on and off. It's been like sunny and cloudy and rainy and stormy. So we're hoping today the weather's good because we have some content that we need to get for social media. So some videos, some photos. So we're going to do that today. Um, I've also got to run this week's training for my money mindset membership. Um, it's a group, a Facebook community group where I go live every single week, providing the community with a money mindset training. And currently the price at the moment, it will increase soon, but it's only $11 Australian to be a part of it. And you can cancel at any time. So it's very much just like a membership for your money mindset, which is really cool and really special. So I'm going to do that today. I have an email to send out to my um, subscribers. And then after that, I don't know, we might chill by the pool, might get a massage, but I'm sure we will keep you guys up to date and take you along for the ride. Let's just prep before she goes live every time. No, no, no. Foy, foy, foy. Foy, foy, foy. Alright, water's here. Me, 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 me. Alright, we good? I think so, hang on. I'm not. <laughs> Um. <laughs> Thank you. Which perfume did you choose? Oh, good choice. Nice <laughs> Thanks. Uh, you good? I'm good. Thanks, Bobby. I love you. Love you. Fuck shit up. Oh. I'll see you in like 20 minutes. No, it is. And you know what to find me? Bye. <clears throat> Hello. What is up, you guys? As you've seen, done a little bit of work today. Um, did went live in my money mindset membership and did the training, and then we went for a bike ride. And we're just getting lunch at Banyu Tree. I think that's what it's called, Banyu Tree. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're just we got getting a lunch. Morning. Yeah, we got a coffee from here this morning. It was really, really good, really yummy. What juice do you have? Um, I don't know the name of it, but it's like mixed in the, um... It's like a turmeric juice. Yeah, it's got celery, um, turmeric and apple, ginger, ginger heaps of different shit. Why do you have that juice? Uh, I'm not feeling too well. It's like a, a yarn, so... <laughs> so I'm having this, uh, having this juice, um, yeah, hopefully it sort me out. It's got a bit of a head cold and a yuck in the gut, so mm -hmm. I think it's from yesterday snorkeling because I was out there for like ages. Yeah. And I think it's like the salt's like really dehydrating me and it's just opened me up to fucking catch anything, so mm -hmm. we'll see how we go. Should be right. I'm strong boy. Strong boy. Fingers crossed. What drink did you get? I just got like a little <coughs> passion fruit wine, so I'm just, just a little bit of this. 
Yum. What's up, you guys? So today is our last day before we leave the island we leave the island tomorrow so on our last day we pack the day before we get everything ready and then we just leave out the clothes that we need to make it really easy so that we're not like waking up stressing on the day that we have to leave because we have to get up really early tomorrow the boat leaves at nine and we have to be there an hour before so we have to be there at 8 a.m um so we've got our horse and cart scheduled because that's what you kind of need to help you get around the island especially if you've got lots of luggage um so we've got the horse and cart scheduled tomorrow for 7 30 a.m and we're currently just going around the room packing it's a bit of a kerfuffle, but that's okay. So yeah, it's gonna be fun. And as soon as we finish packing, then we're just gonna chill. Ethan's super under the weather um, today. So he'll probably nap and then we'll go get some lunch afterwards. So we're at lunch, we're back at the banyan tree, where we were yesterday, <laughs> but we're sitting outside and there's a horse on a boat. There is a horse on a boat and we're just curious to see how they're going to get this horse off the boat. Just got uh, got our lunch today. I'm still feeling like pretty crook as a dog. Um, so we're going back with the uh, what's what's my juice called again? Turmeric. Turmeric juice and it's got heaps of stuff I don't like, but it, it made me feel really good yesterday when I had it. So um, yeah, I'm gonna have that. And then I got the uh, smoothie bowl. It's got real going really really healthy today. Um, and what did you get, Bobby? Mind you, it's a chocolate peanut butter smoothie bowl. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's still healthy. Look at it. It's nice. <laughs> I got the chocolate, um, chocolate overnight chia pudding, and then I got the green. I got a green juice. Mhm. Mm Yum. Hey. Good morning, vloggy vlog. This is our last um, day in Gilly T, or well, pretty much like our last few hours because we uh, just packed it, finished packing all our bags up, um, get ready for the horse and cart to come and get us. So we'll take that out to the front, get it ready. Um, yes, yeah, had a big storm last night, pissed down rain. Um, baby's a bit crook now too, unfortunately. But um, yeah, I'm still a bit crook as well. But um, yes, yeah, so we're getting the ferry over to Gilly. Oh, uh, Gilly, going to Cooter, sorry, uh, to Cooter. So we're going back to the same port. I can't remember exactly the name of the port we came um, from. Uh, we first came to Gillies, but um, we were heading back there. Then um, uh, one of my fr friends, um, Tommy, he's picking us up. Um, he's picking us up from the port and then taking us to Cooter, which we stay in Cooter for one night. Um, and then you catch a plane tomorrow f to go to Singapore.
currently out at the uh, Discovery Shopping Mall in Kuda. We've got the Kuda all good. Set up with some nikes. How are you feeling? Not it. I'm just not feeling it, to be honest. <laughs> so, yeah. She's struggling. She's got the sickness that I have. Um, but yeah, so it's pretty hot in Kuda. Tell you that. But yeah, so just out shopping. Go to find a phone case and look some shoes because maybe shoes are a bit. Yeah, a bit cooked. Shane got them just recently for Christmas. So. so here's what we just went and got. Um, got some body lotion. So we ran out. Got some body lotion. We got some um, stuff for like some cream and some tablets for baby girl's look because she's got a cold sore. Then she got some new shoes. They actually look really comfortable. They got the um, gel. Gel. gel foam in there. Then we got uh, some chop chop bites, a little uh, rainbow cup sort of things. I've had these in Australia, but for some reason, like the ones in Bali, are so much better. They slap. They slap way better than the Aussie ones for some reason. I have no clue. Then we got some Van Hooten, uh, like, I think it's like chocolate almonds. So I think maybe there's some uh, cashews, some sweet and spicy, and then a um, soft chocolate cookie. That's for me, because I love cookies. What is up, you guys? So today, Ethan shared with you that we went shopping, got a few things. I also got a new phone case. It's so cute. So random. And then I updated my wallpaper, which is really cool. Got this off of... Pinterest. Anyway, we are just chilling in bed because we're both pretty under the weather. So we got some room service. I got me goring and then soda water, lime and ice. I'm really starting to, or I'm trying to get rid of soft drink from my life, especially because we've been traveling. And you know, when you travel, it's like that holiday mindset of like, oh, you can have the cake and you can have the soft drink because it's a, a holiday thing. But the thing is, this is like our lifestyle for the foreseeable future. So I don't want to get in, what is going on with my hair? I don't want to get into those like mindset, um, what would you say? Those mindset pitfalls where it's like, oh, we're on holidays because we're not. And this is very much like a lifestyle. So instead of having like Coke Zero or Coke No Sugar for dinner, um, or with dinner, I should say, we are doing this. What are you doing? Nothing. <laughs> you would... well, my burger's not really healthy, eh? Oh, you got a burger? Yeah, it's got like a beef patty and a chicken patty on <laughs> Oh my gosh. Well, there you go. I got a healthy vegetarian with boring because as you guys know, I'm vegetarian now. Um, but yeah, back to what I was saying, we get soda water, ice, and then some lime. And it just, it does the, the fizzy trick, you know, when you just need a bit of fizz, um, but you don't want the nasties. And we are in our little robes, chilling, watching some Discovery Channel and eating our room service. So we're going to close out the vlog here because tomorrow we are off to Singapore and we are going to film a whole new vlog for Singapore, which is very exciting. So if there's anything that you think we should be getting up to in Singapore, make sure you put in the comments because we literally are like listening to people when someone's like, oh, you should go here. You should try that. This mm -hmm. we're adding it to the list and we're genuinely doing it. So we really appreciate it. We're not just saying, oh, do it for clickbait or to boost the algorithm. Like we actually want to know. So make sure you do that. And then to keep updated with these vlogs, make sure that you are subscribed to the channel. So then you get notified when you we... turn, turn notifications on. Okay. So, yeah. if you got to turn notifications on all well, that lighting is not good. Um, anyway, you shine bright like my lad. <laughs> anyway, we love you guys. We appreciate you guys and we will see you on the next vlog. Bye guys. Peace out dudes.